Does the battery did the battery die? By doing one lag? Oh, the battery's flipping out. I'm wondering if I actually killed this battery. All right, so before we get started with the video, please join the channel as a member. P please like and share this video and please subscribe to the channel. I hope you guys enjoy. So already today what we are going to do is we are going to explore a little bit more of the Milwaukee M18 one inch impact wrench. Now, one thing that I already did, I'll put the video right here. I already did a video of taking off semi truck lug nuts. Uh, that video is right here. And so I wanted to explore this a little bit more when it comes to the consumption of batteries. Now, what we are going to do is we are going to drive in a lot of 10 inch lags with different types of batteries. And I want to see if the batteries actually completely drain with the power of this tool. All right, so we're going to use a 3 amp hour regular battery, a 2 amp hour regular battery, a 3 amp hour high output. And I am going to drive in one with a 12 amp hour battery high output. Now, all these batteries are full. And this is going to be an interesting one because I'm curious to see on how these batteries drain with this size of a motor. Alrighty, so first we are going to do a 2 amp hour battery. <laughs> yeah, that looks absolutely terrible. But what I want to do is I want to drive in one, then take it out. Then I'm going to drive in uh, a couple until the battery is dead. I guarantee you this battery is not going to last long at all. So this, uh, so this test should not be long. So we're going to do only, only do 10 inch lags and this is going to be interesting. It is going to be on speed four. Yeah, this is going to be, this is going to be awesome. So I'm, I, this test, this really, this test is to really indulge myself because I'm curious. I am 100% curious. We are not using any pre-drilled holes. So right here should be good. Ready? Go. A little bit more, a little bit more. Let's continue, then we'll check the battery. Oh, well, we need to reverse a little bit. This is a bad mamma jamma though. All right, so uh, we're gonna take it out, then we'll check the battery. And I'm curious to see what that battery is. Like, like it, it did it slow, but I'm curious to see on, on that battery. So let's take it out. Ready? Go. Oh, it's in a reverse. Does the battery, did the battery die? By doing one lag? Oh, the battery's flipping out. The battery is flipping out. I'm wondering if I actually killed this battery. Do it one more time. You know, yeah, I'm not too sure. I might have killed that battery, but let's go to uh, let's go to the next one. This is why I do these tests because so if I I'd rather replace a battery than you having to, just in case if you decided to use a two amp hour battery because you had one more little, a little bit to do and the rest of your batteries were dead. So that's why I do these tests. All right, so let's do the three amp hour high output. Hopefully this one doesn't die, but we will see. All right, so let's take it out. Ready, go. Time. That did it. Let's check the battery life on that. Whoa, one, it went down one bar. It went down one bar. But let's actually uh, drive it in. Let's drive it in right next to it because I'm curious. All right, so ready? 
All right, let's do a quick battery check on this. Is it still flipping out? Yeah, it's still flipping out. Not sure. I might have broken the battery. All right, so ready? Go. Nope, a little bit more. That has power. That has power. Let's check the battery life on that. Still at three bars. Not too shabby. Right, let's take it out. Let's uh, go to go to the next one. All right, so ready? Go. That has some power to it. See, but... Yeah, that has some power to it. Oh, let's check the battery life on that. The battery is at three bars still. All right, let's go to the regular three amp hour. Regular three amp hour battery. Three amp hour. Battery is full. Let's see what this can do. Let's see what the time difference is between high output and this. This is actually a perfect example to see the difference between a high output and a regular because this is going to stress the uh, cells out so badly to where you could see the difference between a better battery with 21700 cells compared to uh, a average battery with 18650 cells. This is a perfect example. We'll do it right here. All right, so ready, go. That's it, time. Let's see the battery life. Battery life is at half. Let's wait a, let's wait a minute. Let's up oh, three, three bars left. Three bars left on the battery. All right, so let's take that out. Oh, let's check the status on the two amp hour. Yep, I think I killed the two amp hour. You know, I'm gonna put, go put this on charge. Ooh, the battery's getting hot. 104 degrees, this battery's at. 104 degrees. Yep, I might have uh, I might have killed this battery. That's all right. That, that's what these tests are for. All right, so let's take this out. Let's see. We'll see what the time difference is. All right, so ready, go. Time. Let's see. Batteries at three bars, and this battery is not glitching out at all. So the two amp hour battery is, I, I think the two amp hour battery is screwed. All right, so let's do the eight amp, the, let's do the 12 amp hour. Now this is what this tool is actually designed for. Battery is full on the 12 amp hour. Right there is good. All right, so ready, go. Oh, sorry, needs to go in reverse forward. Ready, go. Time. Wow, this thing is a beast. Even though the, the funny thing is, all right, I'll show you guys really quick. This is gonna be a little teaser. This is gonna be, this is gonna blow your mind. What, what I gotta do is I gotta do a whole video about uh, this battery. Let's try the 12 amp hour battery on the, you know, yeah, we'll use the hammer drill, but we're not using the hammer drill feature. So let's see if the hammer drill could actually drive the 10 inch lagging faster than the than that impact wrench can i think this will destroy that time all right so ready go oh that's some speed one sorry continue it, oh it it broke loose
time. 10 inch lag. Drove it in with the M18 hammer drill. And I pretty I do not know what the time is, but I'm pretty sure it's faster than the, that impact. All right, so update on the battery. The two amp hour battery, the battery has three bars. It just needed to relax for a little bit. Now I'm pretty sure it needs to cool down because the battery is, yeah, it's cooling down. Now the battery's at 96 degrees. All right, so let's take it out with the impact wrench. All right, so ready, go. This, I love this tool. This thing's a beast. All right, so let's do the hammer drill. All right, so ready, go. Time. Not too shabby. This 12 amp hour battery is a beast. All right, so that is pretty much it. I just wanted to pretty much do a video uh, of testing the batteries on this bad boy. Uh, plenty more videos coming up. I am going to do a versus video between this and the other version of the one inch impact wrench. We're at 30,000 subscribers. I have a lot of plans for this channel. And that also includes welding. I am going to become a, a welder. I want to seriously uh, practice and study the art of welding. So uh, yeah, this channel is going to hardcore get into welding which also means a lot of tools that uh, work on metal are going to be on this channel. All right, so angle grinders are going to be pretty much huge on this channel coming up soon. Alrighty, so this is a bad mamma jamma. This thing is seriously wicked powerful, and you could also use it one-handed. You are not required to actually use the handle that is attached to it. All right, so this is model number 2867-20. There are four speed settings. You know, it also supports the one key but the specs only give everything on speed four. And so this goes to 1,650 RPM on speed four and on speed four, it goes to zero to uh, 2,450 impacts per minute. Now this thing is crazy powerful. Like I said, it's a one inch. So that is a heavy duty anvil. That's, it's huge. All right, so that's pretty much it, you guys. I hope you found this video helpful and, and entertaining. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.